Hi everybody, how are you doing? Today I have got a video that is not planned really. Um, I have been on the hunt for a new work bag for a while because my current one, my current work bag is this from Mango, which I got, I was, it was about two years ago because I was in this flat, um, but the zip, this is open at the moment, but this zip on this side, it's not going to do it now, is it? When I've got stuff in it, it's starting to, like, when there is actually stuff in here, the zip just remains open. It's broken, basically. So I've been on the hunt for a new work bag. Um, and this was from Mango, if I didn't say. It's in, like, PVC, which is quite durable, to be honest. This is fine, apart from there's wear on the corners and stuff. And my stipulations for work bag were has to have handles, has to have crossbody strap, um, and then zipped as well. Because I've had in the past Ted Baker. If you've been here a while, I've had a Ted Baker satchel a long time as well. I've still got that, but it's very tatty now. Um, so yeah, they were my stipulations of this. And this cost $59.99. I don't believe it was in the sale. I'm not sure. I'm not 100% sure on that. cannot remember. As I said, it was unplanned. I was just, I was literally googling men's large briefcase bag because that is kind of a briefcase style. Um, also a stipulation is black, I prefer black bag for work. Um, so yeah, I was just googling it and fossil came up. I've got a massive box here, so I obviously made a fossil order. Fossil is a brand that I am obviously aware of. My mum's got a fossil purse from them that she got in Vista Village for like £12 or £10 quite a few years ago. I think that was 2016 because I think she bought it for Malta. Um, and that's still going strong. It's still tracking, but that's made of canvas with very limited leather on it. Um, and I've never really looked into their bags because they're fairly expensive. Um, for what I want to pay, I don't want to pay anything more than 60 at the top end, really. Um, so yeah, that leads on to today and today i've got an unboxing of what i got on fossil so when i was googling men's large briefcase black briefcase bag i think i googled um it, you know the shop bit on google that comes up at the top it was literally one of those and i scrolled along and it said 70 pounds so i clicked on there and had a little look spoiler i have actually opened this already um, and this is the inside, it's got like cactuses and stuff on it. Um, let me just put it down there like that. Um, it came with an envelope which I haven't actually opened. Um, it's just got fossil on here and it's got documents enclosed. Thank you from fossil. Um, it came fairly quickly. When did I order this? I think it came in two days and shipping was free. I think I ordered it on like, it might tell me on here. It came today, which is the 30th, and I think I ordered it on the 28th. Um, this just says, we strive for any customer service. Have 30 days to return. blah de blah this must be my invoice. I have ordered, actually, can't speak. I have actually ordered another thing from Fossil, which is a wallet. Um, and if that does come before this video is going to go live, I'll add this on to it as well. Um, this does not have how much it cost. Does it have when I ordered it on here? Yeah, so I ordered it on the 28th of December um, and it came on the 30th. So two days, didn't have to pay anything, came UPS. Um, what else was I going to mention? Yeah, it's got the name of the bag here, which I'll say now, which was the Evan Work Bag Black. And I'll just go through it with you. So I opened it up and literally it was in a dust bag. So you, that's, you know it's fancy then and this it's a nice dust bag. It's got a drawstring but like no toggle or anything. I can and as soon as you open the box you could smell it. This is genuine 100% leather so it is quite soft and I'm a bit tiny bit worried about it because it is quite delicate feeling but this is my new work bag um 
yeah so I this is an overview of it it has got brown handles but I don't mind about that but the main body of the bag is black the brown handles kind of throw it off a bit it makes it look like a dark chocolate but I'm pretty sure it's black the colour said black on the um thing and it's got a black on the tag here so yeah so this is what it looks like from the front there is a small very small slip pocket at the front here side view is that that's the back view another side view what's happening see it's already going a bit funny there already i haven't really looked at this too much because i've been playing with my niece all day and then that's the bottom which is brown um and then i should also show you that's the top so it's got two zipper pulls up there i'm trying to be very careful with it because it's not actually a grained it is the leather is a bit grained i don't know if you're gonna be able to see yeah so it's grained but it's like soft whereas and i actually wanted to bring this bag out because i wanted to compare sizes um this is grained but you could like rub your finger on it all day and it won't leave too much of a mark uh yeah it's not gonna leave a mark Whereas I think that would, let me, because I've not done this yet. This is literally me comparing sizes right now. Okay, that is pretty comparable. Side view, I'm guessing, actually I might have that a bit further forward than it is. But uh, actually, I'm, I don't know how I'm going to do this without dropping them. This is a proper review, isn't it? Can you see the width of it is actually pretty comparable. This one just looks wider because it's probably got more stuff in it, obviously. And I'm going to have to slim down my stuff for work. But this, as you can tell, has got two zip pockets. And this has only got one, which is actually what I wanted because that one of the zip pockets in the other bag is very thin. Whereas this is larger obviously let me talk you through the price so i've actually got the price on the back here the original price of this which i would never have paid is 279 pounds i know shocking um and that's 299 euros so 300 euros basically for this work bag i paid 59.99 which is like a what is that 200 and 20 pounds off someone work out the percentage for me in the comments for that but that is really good so originally it came in at 70 pounds which was in the sale which i thought was quite good anyway because that is what is that 210 pounds off for this um where yeah and then i saw you could get an extra 15 percent off if you're a new customer and i've never bought anything on um this website before fossil so it came down to 59.99 and then i was going to check out but i didn't i had a little look to see what else they got and i bought a wallet as well which was originally 19 it went down to 16 um so all in all i paid like 75 pound for everything which is only five pound more than what the sale price of this was um so yeah i'm gonna ooh, just go through here and I want to see how big it is. Okay, the zips are very smooth. I don't know if you can see that. Very smooth. And they come down the side like this. And then it opens up like that. It's got a lot of tissue paper in here. Some of it is fossil branded, some of it is not. There should be a shoulder strap in here there is it looks like this this is just a like fabric it's not well maybe it's kind of thick canvas fabric strap which is fine i didn't want a leather one or anything to be honest um oh there's a little book in here um yeah so just a fabric handle um strap even and it's got little leather bits which i'm guessing leather on there as well I'm smelling it because this bag, like I say stinks, you can tell it's a leather bag. Um, it smells of leather, it really does. Um, it smells like a Clark shoe shop. Look how wide that opens, wow. Okay, I might not 
open it that wide you might leave it like that has it got a little no okay i'm just getting my bearings because i haven't seen this yet um and the hardware on this is like a brassy gold which extends onto the bag here as well and there is i don't know if you can see that it says a little bit of fossil in like embossed or is that debossed embossed on there so in terms of inside the bag there is a compartment in here i don't know if you're going to see that there you go that is like where you can put a laptop and it's got a little card in here what is this probably a care booklet or something i'm guessing yeah this product will naturally carry some texture and colour variations in the leather, which make it unique. Uh, so you want to avoid contact with water, oil, makeup and other items that contain permanent dyes. Okay. Hopefully, I won't have to clean it that much. But, yeah, let's just put that back in there. And it does say, if I open it up a bit more... It does have a fossil leather tab there. And then on this side, there is a bigger pocket and then a smaller pocket here, there and there. I don't know how well you can see that, which is good because then I can slit, slit, slip stuff in there, like my wallet and stuff. Um, yeah, so that padded one section up the top here on the other side is where you are meant to be able to put like a laptop it's like padded inside um i've got a separate laptop bag for work so i won't be doing that but yes i will probably be doing another video of what can fit in here um i don't know if anyone wants that but i will be doing a what in, in my bag um when it's not stuffed it looks quite thin actually but Hopefully this will do. As I said, it's a bigger, it look, it feels bigger inside. It feels quite roomy um, than my bag that I've got at the moment. I probably will just put in the stuffing again, just to keep it straight. A lot of the stuff that's in my bag currently probably doesn't need to be in there. There's a lot of rubbish that needs clearing out. Um, and, the actual middle bit here which is like the divider does take up some room as well so that would be um would make more space if that makes sense also the inside is not leather it's just like a nylon-y material so yes that is my new bag um for work i got it i'm so i'm like it the price ridiculous such a good price for like this bag, which was from Mango, was the same price. And this is obviously a fossil bag, which is a bit of, well, better brand. Um, so hopefully the zip and stuff will stay the same. I would say the zip on this is plastic, whereas this is metal. So I don't know whether that means anything. I did like this for the time that I used it, the Mango one. And I would I would keep it if, if the zip hadn't have freaking broken because um, it's very annoying and it gets caught and it's just like otherwise I would have guess kept that and not looked for anything else but I'm hoping this will stand the test of time because it is a more expensive bag like this is 270 quid which is 200 pounds more than what a mango bag is um but I got it for the price of a mango bag so I'm happy with that but as I'm saying fossil is like no I think it's quite a good make um and I think this will hopefully stay the test of time. What's that phrase? Can't think of what the phrase is. But hopefully it will last a long time. And I actually like warming to the brown and the black combination. It does mean that you can wear brown and black with it, doesn't it? Not that I'm really worried about that. I wear brown boots with my black bag anyway. So yeah, let me just attach, because it's got D-rings here. And here I'll just attach the shoulder strap, which is fully adjustable because it's got one of those on. So you can adjust it however you like, which is great. That D-ring is quite stiff, but that's fine. So yeah, this shall be my new work bag for 2022. So that's the next time I'm going to be in work. So yes, 
Thank you guys for watching this bag. If you have watching this bag, watching this video, if you have any experience with Fossil, let me know down below. I would say the shipping and everything was really quick, really smooth, really easy. I wasn't really like until you read the email, it said that um, your order might come in two shipments. And at the time I'm filming this part of the video, if I film the middle, like extra portion, I'm not sure yet. I haven't received the other item, but I did receive a confirmation email today to say that um, it all should be arriving tomorrow. So we'll see about that. I would say that something which had a mild panic attack about was when I was looking at my bank statement online after I purchased this, it had two payments, which it still does. One said 75 and one said six, 75 something and one said 16 something. And I was like, and that was in the pending section. I should have prefaced that pending section. Um, and I was like, okay, hopefully it will just rectify itself, which it did because this purchase has gone through as 59.99 um and that is now as a completed transaction and the other purchase of 16 pound whatever is still impending because they haven't shipped it yet so i had a mild panic attack over that i was like oh my god am i gonna have to talk to customer services and be like what the hell is happening um it would have been nice for that to be like communicated to you that things might be in two different places or have two different statements on your bank statement but anyway it is what it is it, it rectified itself but it was a bit of a mild panic at like oh my god let me know your thoughts or experiences with fossil down below and um, the only other time i've been had anything to do with fossil is going into the fossil store in vista village um but let me know your thoughts down below if you've not already please subscribe hit that bell down below um and follow me on my instagrams which are always linked down below and i'll see you in my next video Bye.